County speakers and members of county assembly may have to wait a little longer for the implementation of the 4.5 million shilling car grant awarded to them by President Uhuru Kenyatta. Well, this is after the controller of budget slammed the brakes on the initiative, saying there was no provision in law to implement it. Well, in a letter to the Salaries and Remuneration Commission, the controller of budget also stated that some counties do not have the funds to make the payments. Now, with the car grant gift to the MCAs largely seen as a sweetener to motivate the county assemblies to approve the BBI bill, the big question now is, will the delay in its implementation result in rebellion? Chemitai Guin reports. Days after the Salaries and Remuneration Commission gave governors the note to effect the conversion of car loans for speakers and members of the county assemblies into car grants. <laughs> the president's gift to the ward representatives has now run into headwinds. In a letter to the SRC copied to the Council of Governors and the County Assemblies Forum, control of budget Dr. Margaret Nyakango raised a red flag that is now bound to slow down the implementation process. The control of budget stated that though they had received numerous requests from governors to authorize withdrawals from the county revenue funds to finance the car grants, there were four fundamental issues affecting the implementation of the president's directive and hence sought the SRC's advisory on how to deal with the hurdles. She noted that some of the counties were faced with the difficulty of implementing the directive due to insufficient funds since most had only budgeted for car loan facility and not a car grant, while others had merged the car loan and the mortgage into one fund. She added that there was no legislation outlining the process of conversion of a car loan into a car grant since the car loan facility had been created as a revolving fund. She further stated that while reviewing the request by governors, she noted that in some counties, the speakers and MCAs had not accessed the car loan facility. In some, the car loan had been granted and fully paid. In others, the loan was borrowed and partially paid, while in other counties, MCAs and speakers had accessed the car loan from the joint car and mortgage fund catering for both county staff and members of the county assembly we didn't get a vote for any abstention neither did we get a vote for for no the hurdle according to the control of budget was on how to effect the car grant since each county had its own unique challenges then you as a simple opinion say aye. Aye. with 11 counties having so far approved the bbi bill next week having been termed by bbi proponents as a decisive week where more counties are set to consider the bill will the developments throw the process into disarray <laughs> 24 county assemblies are required to approve the bill for it to move to the National Assembly. Chamutai Goin, Citizen TV, Nairobi.